Yeah, it's tough. Um, obviously, definitely didn't get the results we wanted. But in this league, you know, this is how it goes. You, we don't take care of the football. You know, we didn't feel like we got enough turnovers. I mean, obviously we had a turnover, but we got called back on the flag. Uh, we just didn't play better than their defense. Their defense came out, made some plays. Um, it's the way it goes, but we don't have really enough time or a lot of time to pout and, you know, complain. Once we get on this plane, i watch the film, flush it, go out the plane. It's on the San Fran. What did you guys make of that DPI on Christian? I think the majority, like I don't know if I get fine or whatever, but I think the majority of the calls in this game was complete BS. I think the pass interference on Buster, I think he was turning around playing the ball. They were just hand fighting. Uh, I think even the hit on Christian, you know, I don't think it was a dirty play. I think he was trying to make a play on the ball and just lost the ball out. Unfortunately, the guy got hurt. And also the pass interference on the, in the end zone. So the one drive fueled by penalties, they got a touchdown. Um, but the rest of the game, I really felt like the defense was flying around, playing with speed. So I told all the guys when it was QB kneeling, like, I'm really proud of the effort the defense played with today. How do you handle those, those penalties in the moment? I mean, would you say anything to your teammates? I mean, what, what's kind of the, the situation there? I mean, just keep playing. I mean, as, especially as a defensive back, we understand that even if they make a big play, you have to just, you know, forget it and play the next play. Uh, that's just our mentality. So, I mean, obviously, during the game, you ain't really have too much time to complain to the rest because they don't work. It's not basketball or nothing like that. So, um, it's just one of those things where we just got to keep playing and uh, just try to find ways when we get into practice and watch the film to correct those mistakes if there was mistakes that was made by, on our part. These are the kind of games that bother you the most when you maybe play well, especially in large parts of the game, but turn the ball over and, and kind of lose because of mistakes you made? Yeah, I mean, at the end of the day, man, we're a family. This is a team thing. We obviously didn't play complimentary football. You know, defense played well. Special teams made some plays. Offense turned the ball over. But they had some good drives, some good plays as well. So uh, I don't, you know, try to look at it like, oh, we played well and point the finger. No, that's not the way it goes. Uh, I feel like, especially as a leader on the defense, a leader of this team, um, and I'm, I'm not the guy to make excuses for anybody, but when you got guys, we got a lot of injuries on offense. You know, as a defense, we got to, you know, we got we to carry the torch, and we got to go out there and, hold, and you know, set the tempo every single game. So I felt like we did that, but at the end of the day, um, if their defense is getting turnovers, we got to get more turnovers. So that's that mentality. You feel like Zach maybe gave you guys a spark play. What was it like playing with him for the first time? Yeah, it was fun. I seen him flying around. Obviously, I was on the field, but he was flying around, crossing my face mask and stuff like that. So uh, I think the defense is overall just playing with a lot of swagger, and we just talked about it all week pregame, just speed, speed, speed. And uh, um, I felt it on the field, and I know the coaches felt it on the sideline. Um, like you said, I think we just got to keep playing with that swagger uh, to give ourselves a chance to win ball games. You guys had Bud Dupree out with you for the coin toss. Did he say anything to you guys before this game, just given his familiarity here with the Steelers and the Pittsburgh and everything? No, I mean, I think Bud did a good job of not trying to make it about him and his revenge game and things like that. Bud's been busting his behind trying to get back and play for us. Uh, made a couple of plays today, so I'm definitely happy for him. I know this game probably meant a lot for him, being getting drafted here in Pittsburgh. So, uh, But like I said, he didn't, he didn't necessarily make it about him. Obviously, I feel like he was really amped up, but, you know, he did a good job of not making a distraction. Three out of four, really on the wrong side of the turnover battle. Now that you're in the crunch of things, could have the number one seed coming out of today. Just really feel about where you guys are and where you're, where you're headed based on how you're playing right now. Yeah, obviously, you know, we're banged up. Guys got to get, you know, healthy. Short, short week, you know, short week in San Fran. Don't really have a lot of time to really, you know, try to think about all these different AFC pitchers and stuff like that. Uh, best case scenario, we went out. And that's all we can do. Um, we can't be concerned about what other teams are doing, things like that. If we went out, we think we'll have put ourselves in a really good position. So um, that's the mentality. Go out there, try to win a ball game on Thursday night. What about just the opportunity to potentially earn a home, at least one home playoff game? Yeah, I mean, it's attractive, you know, but at the end of the day, we got to go out there and handle our business. If we don't handle our business, it doesn't matter. So uh, we just got to focus on, you know, one day at a time, one, eight, one game at a time. So, like I said, we'll – Watch the film on the, on, the, on the plane, and after that, man, on the San Fran. Coming out of the bye week, you guys are saying back to basics and fundamentals to generate those turnovers. Was today just a lack of fundamentals and, and back to the basics, and was it just like what, what happened to keep you guys with You know, I don't think it was a lack of basics at all. I think, you know, when you're talking about flying around, guys were making really good open field tackles. wasn't a lot of missed tackles. And even when they were, there was another guy coming, another guy coming. It's just like guys were just flying around. Um, like I said, we had a turnover. Uh, but obviously got called back by a penalty, so um, it's just one of those things where I just feel like as a defense, if we just keep flying, flying to the ball, doing what we're doing, the ball's going to come out, the ball's going to find us on the back end, we're going to get more interceptions. So, uh, like I said, just one of those things that just didn't happen today, but at the end of the day, I'm really proud of the effort that we played with on defense.